Well, again, I think giving back and helping to educate people. A lot of people feel that insurance is a necessary evil. <laughs> and um, they, no matter how great the service is, sometimes they don't like to deal with it. But so I think just helping people and educating people and being able to protect their assets. From a business perspective of somebody considering going into this industry, one of the great positives is what's called residual income. So once you have clients on your books, auto home, umbrella insurance, and a lot of times commercial businesses as well, um, will renew with you. If you've given them the good service, they renew and you have service work during the year, but not nearly as much as getting new clients. So you have automatic renewals. And those renewals are residual income that you're not having to go out there and look for to bring in new business. Most valuable thing that I've learned is that sometimes you have to let things roll off your shoulders. And this is really more of a personal thing than a business thing. You can incorporate it into business because this can be at times a very stressful business. It can be lucrative and it can be rewarding, but it can also be very stressful. And sometimes you have to just let things go. And um, I think we talked about it was, you know, finding the balance because this is, there's not, there's some gray area, but it's a lot of black and white in this business. And there's certain things you can do to help people and there's certain things that you have no control over. So I think learning to let some of those things go doing what you can to assist people with their claims and their service and knowing when to just realize that there's nothing more that you can do. Um, I think that's one of the most valuable things, if that makes sense. Thank you for watching A Wise Way. Subscribe to stay updated, share to pass the knowledge, or view our other videos on the left.